To, to achieve the physical feats you, you've, you've accomplished over the last couple of decades, you, you've, you've had to train like an athlete. You once trained with a boxer at Mil Milford Camp, but you've always held that the mind is central to your performances. How is the mind central? Well, I think I, I used to say that, but now I think that all things are connected. The mind is not so separate from the body. It's the mind and the physical. It's like all together. And uh, the more I work one thing, the, the other part is working at the same time. It can't be dissociated so much. If we do dissociate them, maybe it's not, so, it's not maybe the best way to evolve. Say, so I'm just going to work the body for a couple of years, and then I work my brain. I think it doesn't go that way. What is the brain part? It's what you think about everything while you... Uh, uh, it's like the creativity is with the brain. Mm. Uh, your body surprises you because sometimes the brain is limiting what you think you can do. And the body will show the mm. brain like, oh, maybe you, you thought it was not possible, but the body does it. But sometimes the brain has great ideas also, so the body can aim for that. You also have to have a strength and determination in your brain to be able to pull off some of what you do on stage, right? Is it like that? I mean, like, like an athlete, like a hockey player, or, or like, you More know? More than a hockey player. <laughs> Much more. Sorry. What, that's okay. Tell, why, why did you say well, that so aggressively? Uh, no, it's not aggressive. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, no, but why, why do you feel hockey. that so? Yeah, why, like why is it hockey. so much more than a hockey player? Well, hockey, uh, they play when they do 17 minutes on ice. They consider it's a big game. <laughs> and <laughs> yeah. they rarely do four nights in a row. Uh, I mean, I can go on and on. Right. They're basically slackers, those hockey players. <laughs> <laughs> 